Hello everyone, welcome to NG Classes YouTube channel. In this video lecture, we will consider a numerical on periodic and aperiodic signals. The task is to determine whether the given signals are periodic or not. If periodic, we need to find the fundamental period. The first numerical, we will consider in this video lecture the very first numerical, wherein uh, the input signal x of n is equal to sin 3n. This signal is a discrete time sinusoidal signal. Uh, we have got a condition for a discrete time sinusoidal signal to be periodic. The condition is its angular frequency. So let me write the condition first. The angular frequency. The angular frequency is being represented as omega. Its angular frequency omega must be a rational multiple of 2 pi. So I would write a 2 pi 2 pi into m divided by capital N. So this condition says that the angular frequency of a discrete time sinusoidal signal must be a rational multiple of 2 pi. If this condition is satisfied, we would say this given signal is periodic and later uh, this n is its fundamental period. So now we'll consider the signal sin 3n. So if I want to find, uh, if I want to determine whether it is periodic or not, the very first task is I need to compare that. Uh, I would write comparing, comparing the given signal. The given signal is sin 3n. I need to compare this signal with sin omega n. This is the standard signal. So I can get omega equal to. Therefore, the angular frequency omega is equal to. Just compare, I would get 3. Its angular frequency is 3 now. Can I express this omega in terms of 2 pi into m divided by capital N? That is the question. As we do not have any pi term over here, we would say that this angular frequency cannot be represented as a rational multiple of 2 pi. Are you getting the point? This angular frequency cannot be represented, cannot be represented, cannot be represented as 2 pi into m divided by capital N. Hence, this signal is straight away I would say it is non-periodic. Are you getting the point? It is non-periodic or it is also known as a periodic signal. Is that okay? So whenever we get a numerical on sinusoidal term, first check is pi term is there or not. If the pi term is not there, I could straight away say that the given signal is non-periodic. What is the reason? The reason behind that is the angular frequency as it cannot be represented as a rational multiple of 2 pi, the answer is non-periodic. Thank you for watching. Uh, next question, next two numericals we will consider in the next uh, video lecture. Thank you so much for watching.